One big lie of patriarchy is that we need to give every guy a chance and even if we give them a chance, we need to give them a second chance as if we cannot trust our own intuition, our own inner voice. Just because somebody asks you out does not mean you have to accept. If you're not attracted to them, if something feels off, if something doesn't feel right, you just might not be into it, you just might not be dating right now. You can say no to that. Also, if you do go out with someone and the vibes ain't vibing, there's no attraction, there's no spark, the conversation ain't conversating, you see them be rude to somebody, they might not be a bad person. It's not always they're a bad person. Sometimes y'all just not clicking. It's okay to just end it there. You don't have to keep going. It's that trick of the patriarchy that has men delusionally believing that they can have anybody that they want to. This is why you go to the gas station and you get hounded. They think that you're going to just be attracted to them. They think that if you, if they cat call you when you're walking down the street, that you're going to be okay with that. Because unfortunately under patriarchy, there are women who believe that every guy that talks to them, they need to give that guy a chance. There are also so many women who have settled under patriarchy because they think they need to give guys chance after chance and understand and maybe it was this and maybe it was that and then they wind up settling for a complete loser or at the very least somebody who isn't necessarily a loser but there's just nothing there. It doesn't always mean that the person is a bad person. I don't always get a, get a vibe and click with every person I meet whether it's romantic or pl platonic. And vice versa, people don't always click with me. And that doesn't make us bad people. It's just our energies don't match. Okay, move on and go to the next person. It is from a mindset of lack and desperation that you got to say yes to everybody. And that when they showed you that there was nothing there or a red flag or whatever the first time, you didn't believe it and you had to investigate further. Let me make something clear to you guys. Your time cannot not be restored, okay? We are not rechargeable like iPhones. Every minute that we give away is gone forever. And since the beginning of time, these, this is why we hear these horrifying stories of these grandmas who were kidnapped by these men and then they got married and everybody thinks it's a beautiful love story. Ew, no, you're a victim. These men have been conditioned to believe that we're all going to want them. That's why they are fucking delusional all the time. This is why they think that. This is why they become incels when that delusion doesn't pan out and nobody wants them or the people that they want don't want them back because they're delusional. And every time we say yes to every single person just because they ask, every time we don't listen to our first mind and we gotta give them another chance, that's feeding into that whole idea. That's, that's why they think that. Men, they created patriarchy, they uphold it. But guys, this is, this, is, this is where I lose people. This is why I'm not su as successful as other creators who talk about this stuff. Men uphold patriarchy, but sometimes we do things that hold it up too, okay? And I'm just telling you so that things can change, you know? I just want to ultimately help us. I'm not saying you're dumb, because at one point, I didn't know this shit. But we got to start somewhere. And saying no and meaning no unless you genuinely want to say yes is is one of the places we can start to break down patriarchy and 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 lessen the amount of delusional men out here roaming the streets